Hey everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel and today I'm doing another video. Now, as many of you probably know, today I am reacting to season 9 episode 18, I think we're on? Yeah, episode 18, is it? I think we're on episode 18 of The Next Step and I cannot wait. There is so much drama to be resolved and I'm really interested to see what's going on with Grace because she kind of snuck her way back in um, to the last episode, so that is going to be amazing. Um, but first of all, I just wanted to mention why I'm back here. Um, because if you watch my latest What If video, you would have known that I'm in a different place in my room because my ring light was broken. But it turns out I plugged in my heater instead of my ring light. So that is why it didn't switch on. It is in fact not broken, which is great because obviously ring lights are not cheap. Um, so I'm really, really glad that it wasn't broken and that I'm able to be back in my normal filming space. Margie's back again, guys. I actually have no idea why that keeps going on, but okay. Um, but anyway, I'm back in my normal place to continue my reactions to the next step, and I cannot wait to dive into this episode. As always, the clips I put in are owned by the next step and CBBC. They're not owned by me. They're just there to tell you what I'm talking about. Anyway, I'm going to get straight into this episode. I cannot wait. It's not going that great, and I have a lot on my mind today. Are you okay? It is great that Anthony and Adele are taking international seriously. Like, we have not seen many rehearsals at all, so the fact that they're taking it seriously is a great thing for me, and I think that that's going to make their duet really, really strong. Um, but like I said in my internationals prediction, duets never go smoothly at internationals or nationals or anything at the next step, so I still believe something is going to go on, but I just don't know what it is. I woke up early, set my alarm, went to the gym, I even put some moisturizer on. Eldon's outfit is certainly extra. I mean, it's something. Um, but I'm really glad he's taking his role seriously. I think he has a lot of things to make up for um, because of what he has previously been doing. Um, so I'm really pleased that he is taking it seriously. And if changing outfits is gonna do that, then great. That is how you know who's dedicated to this team and who's not. Okay, this is a very smart suggestion from Eldon because a dance can't really like, so, like kind of choose an alternate. You can't really choose an alternate from dance because it's kind of like, a load of different things. So the fact that Eldon suggested that is actually really smart because I don't think they've ever picked alternates from that before. Um, so yeah, I'm really, really pleased with that suggestion and I think it's gonna make like the best alternates ever. I, I thought you would be here with the rest of Team France. I wanted to come back early to get everything sorted out with the team. It's lovely to see Kenzie back. It's been so long since she's been in the studio and it was lovely to hear that Pete kind of went and picked her up from the airport, that's amazing. Um, but like, what I'm confused about is who is dance captain now? Is Kenzie dance captain or, or is Anthony dance captain? Because like, I'm assuming Kenzie is because like she's back, but I don't even know. We did revisions on the large group dance based off of Eldon's amazing dress, so you should learn it. The rest of the team knows it really well. Okay, Anthony's the dance captain. But then like, Kenzie was so passionate to be dance captain in season eight, so I feel like why is she given her role up so easily? I don't know. I just don't think it really fits. Like, I get it. Like. I don't know, I don't really get it actually. Kenzie should be dance captain, but I don't even know. Um, also, why is Team France's dance captain there early? Like, surely the dance captain should be with the team when they fly over? And was her plane ticket not on the other, like, flight with the team? I am just so confused. We need some, like, clearing up going on here, please. Come on, give it a try. Okay. It's great that Ariana's helping Jet. I really like their friendship, and you can just kind of see how much Ariana has changed from now, like, into the start of the season. Like, she has changed so much in a good way, and it's just great that she's such a full team player now. I'm really, really pleased. The essay I wrote was so good. I told them I'd be dancing at internationals, and... I'm so excited for Ethan, because this could be an amazing opportunity for him. But Anthony is picking the alternates, and that is based off of people being distracted, and it's obvious Ethan's distracted. So I feel like this isn't looking good for Ethan. I don't know. I really hope it's not Ethan, though. I really, I, I don't know. This is stressing me out now. Ariana's been talking you up, and she thinks that you should hang out with us. But you're the power trio. It's lovely that the power trio have invited Jet into the group. I don't know if she's going to go for it yet, because they've only asked her. But I feel like that's such a lovely thing for them to do, and I feel like they would make a great four. Um, so yeah, I think that was a really good thing from the writers. I mean, I think it's kind of showing how Elite and the Next Up have fully merged now into this new age group. I love how I'm saying this new age group, I'm an Elite at the end of the season, but I'm really pleased that they did that. That is amazing. So I can continue my plan. And Eldon is my way in. <laughs> Hello, Grace. I actually forgot she existed. I actually feel... I actually, I don't feel bad. She's chaotic, but like, oops. Then leave it to me. What's the address? Okay, let me get it for you. Eldon, please... 
please do not trust Grace with that. That is actually insane. Like, that's the most important, like, dress, I think he said, or prop for internationals. Do not trust Grace with it, because if she knows that, she's going to go and run off with it, isn't she? Like, why wouldn't she do that? I'm actually... No, this is this is so giving elite again, like in, in national stealing their stuff. This is not good. I just think you'd be too distracting because um, you're just too cute. Kenzie is being really unfair with Pete because she's actually, one, she's lying to him and two, internationals is like, in what, two days tomorrow? I don't even know when it is. I can't remember. Someone said, but like, that's not good. Like, she needs to be focusing on like the team. So I'm not happy that she's done that, but you know. Kenzie's Kenzie. I, I trust her choice, but lying to Pete was wrong, and I hope she knows that was wrong. Okay, I'm in. <gasps> yes! Come on, Jupiter! <laughs> okay, let's go. I'm so pleased Jet decided to join the group because I feel like that is the best choice for her. And I feel like that community around her is really, really going to help her get that move. And I just feel like since Sandra left, she's not really had like a group to be a part of. So I feel like now that she's got this group, she's going to feel complete again. <gasps> I made it through to the next round. I've been shortlisted. I'm so happy for Ethan. He literally deserves this so much. Like, he seems so excited about it. And he's probably going to be with Piper too. So that is amazing news. But yeah, he deserves this so much. But I am still worried about the whole alternate thing. Like, he might be the alternate and that could impact his chances. But like, right now, I'm really pleased for him. Excuse me, is this the Barbie song from, what's it called? Dance the Night Away. Like, if you've watched the Barbie film, like, comment if you think this sounds similar, because it literally the intro of this sounds exactly like that Barbie song. Are we finally getting, like, an external song on the next step? Like, that would be so cool. Okay, I got my hopes up too quickly. It's not the Barbie song, but it sounds so like it, like the backing track, that they must have been inspired by it. I mean, it would make sense because they filmed um, season nine last year i'm pretty sure and barbie came out last year so it would make sense if it was but kenzie's dancing is so good if it wasn't for the fact that she was doing something she shouldn't be doing like i would be like so happy but it's an amazing dance but again she shouldn't be doing it think of the team kenz i always think of the team this is the one time i'm thinking of myself pete is definitely right however it is important for kenzie to think about herself but right now the team is should be her priority because like internationals is coming up um, she should either have filmed this audition in advance in France or she just shouldn't have auditioned because doing this now is just not helping anyone. So I just don't agree with what she's doing, to be honest. I don't think it's a good decision. I'm really glad. I am so proud of Jet for getting that move because you could see how it was frustrating her. Um, so I'm really, really proud that she's done that. And yeah, I just think that she wouldn't have been able to do it without everyone else. So the fact she's now done it with that group is amazing. There's traffic at the border. Yeah, I never doubted you for a second. Um, what the heck? Grace actually pulled through. I did not expect that at all. Like, Grace clearly hasn't changed. Like, what I'm thinking, though, is, like, if she's getting the most important prop to come to the next step, what she's got planned must be insane, because, like, surely stealing the prop would be, like, the biggest thing to kind of spoil, like, what's going on. But, like, what I'm really interested to see what she's going to be doing now. Like, honestly, Grace, you're so far in. Just do what you need to do and leave. I know I've done some pretty messed up things, and I don't deserve anyone's trust. I do feel as if I've missed a chapter here, because when did everybody find out about Grace? Like, I know that, who, I can't remember, I'm sure someone mentioned it earlier that Adele maybe said something, but like, when did that happen? Because I would love to have seen the reactions of everyone else, especially Olive's, um, but like, I'm happy, I guess, that she pulled through, like, for them, but it's clear that her intentions are bad, so I'm keeping my eye out on her. I'm going to be one of the international's alternates. What? what? I'm so surprised Kenzie decided to be alternate because in season six, when they were doing the alternate auditions for regional, she literally said she never wants to hear the alternate like name by her name. So like, I'm surprised she did that. But it is the right thing to do because she didn't do what she needed to do. So yes, it is right. But I'm just surprised. Ethan, I'm sorry, but you will be the second alternate. Unfortunately, I'm not surprised Ethan has made the other alternate, because just because like it was kind of coming. We saw that he was distracted today, and I just don't think that today was the right day. If it was a day before, he wouldn't have been, but then Jet would have been. So I'm actually kind of conflicted whether I'd rather have Jet or, Ant or Ethan. 
probably Ethan because Jack didn't have as much of an opportunity to dance at nationals, but like, yeah, I'm still disappointed. He doesn't deserve it. And that was going to be a big problem. So? They bought it. What is going on? Why is France's dance captain Grace's assistant? Like, I did not see that. I actually cannot believe that. I'm shocked. Team France and I are going to watch the next step crumble. The TNS writers are really like surprising me this season. Honestly, this is one of the best seasons of the next step. Like these twists are everywhere. Like what is going on? But I feel like the dance captain of France is teaming up with Grace because they want to take down TNS so they have a better chance of winning internationals. But like, I'm actually, I actually could not believe what was going on right now. Like this is insane. Um, but yeah, I'm, I'm, I think that was a really good plot twist. So I am not complaining about it. Anyway, that was an amazing episode. Like I really, really enjoyed that. It wasn't my favorite. I mean, it wasn't better than season nine, episode 17, but it was very much up there. So I am going to give it a seven out of 10. It was very good, but not amazing like episode 17. Um, probably because Michelle wasn't in it. And I'm pretty sure Michelle's coming back. So when is she coming back? That's what I want to know. Um, but I'm really, really happy with that episode. I love the drama. I love Kenzie solo. And I feel like the team is beginning to prepare for internationals now, which is good because it's literally in like two days. Um, but let me know your thoughts on this episode because I'm sure you all have very different ones to mine and I would love to know what you think. Um, but I will see you very soon for my reaction to season nine, episode 19. I cannot believe we're that far through the season. Anyway, have an amazing day and I'll see you soon. Bye guys.